So you're not actually the first person to comment this, but it's not strictly true. Many people hold the misconception that cricket is a gentleman's game and doesn't have the racist history or present that football does. So we're going to look into it. So cricket was actually a British colonial export to India and the Caribbean, which in cricket is referred to as the West Indies. I believe it was transported by the British East India Company to be specific. Once the slaves were emancipated, cricket became the new cultural institution by which England sought to socialise the populations and reinforce hierarchies in its colonies. And actually, here's where the gentleman's game bit comes in important. It was actually used to keep people out of the sport. Cricket was considered a gentleman's game and all others were excluded by their inability to demonstrate an understanding of cricket's image in the ideal Englishman. And when the clubs first formed across the Caribbean, there were separate clubs for aristocratic white people, merchant class white people, um, and people. Segregation was not allowed, and this was just a way to maintain segregation. Now, after all that, I doubt you're surprised if I tell you that racism is still very prevalent in the sport of cricket today. In March 2021, so just a few months ago, the UK Human Rights Commission was asked to examine racism in English cricket because black and Asian cricketers in the UK have been complaining of discrimination within the sport. When Australia hosted India in January 2021, the Indian team complained of racial abuse by the spectators, specifically two bowlers called Jaspreet Bumrah and Mohamed Siraj. In 2019, England cricketer Jofra Archer experienced racism while playing in New Zealand. A black player called Darren Sammy was racially abused while playing for the IPL in India. And this was by Safaraz Ahmed, the captain of the Pakistan cricket team. Moeen Ali has discussed how he was called Osama and also faced racist abuse during the 2015 Cricket Ashes. Um, for fans of cricket, many are aware of the Monkey Gate scandal where Harbhajan Singh was accused of calling Andrew Simmons a monkey. So if you've got to the end of this video, hopefully you've realised by now that cricket isn't really a gentleman's game. Uh, the gentleman's game thing was just a way of keeping people of colour out of it. And there's actually still a massive amount of racism in the sport today. And the cricket leagues need to do a lot more about it. And so do the players and the spectators who are taking part.